Okay, so, punta tayo kay transitive at intransitive. Okay, so, pag sinabi mo transitive, yun yung tinatawag na tadoshi. Okay, so, tadoshi. And then, intransitive, verb, sila mo yung tinatawag na ji doshi in Japanese. No, so, pag sinabi mo transitive verb, siya yung mga verb na kung saan, particle o, ang ginagamit natin para kay direct object, and then pagkaka-intransitive verb, siya yung ginagamitan na natin ng particle ga. Kung saan, o, merong tinatawag na doer. And then, kay intransitive verb is, walang doer. Kaya particle ga ang ginagamit natin. Okay, so, ano na ano ba yung mga uh, verb o transitive verb na particle o? Okay, so, example ni Akemas to open. Diba? So, pag ginamit mo si Akemas, magiging particle o. Example, Dowa o Akemas. So, meaning may doer. Example, Watashi wa Dowa o Akemas. So, meaning, ako yung doer si Watashi, binuksan ko yung pinto. Dowa o Akemas. Akemas is a transitive verb, kaya ginamit si particle o. Eh, paano ngayon? Gamitin natin siya sa intransitive. Okay? So, kung ang transitive verb niya, kung ang transitive verb is akemas to open, okay, so pag natin ka intransitive verb, meron naman siyang katumbas. See? Ah, ki, mas. Yung halip na ke, magiging ki. Usually kasi, pagka intransitive at transitive, ito yung madali nyo mapapansin. All the same silang open. Pagka kalimitan, pag malambot, ah, ke, mas, si, me, mas. Doon pumapasok siya kay transitive verb. Okay? And then, pagka naman intransitive verb, matigas. Ah, ki, mas, si, mari, mas. Okay? So, di ba, Kanina, example natin is watashi wa doa o akimas. Meaning, meron doer. Transitive verb kaya particle o. Pag naging intransitive verb yan, doa ga akimas. Meaning, wala na si watashi kasi wala kang doer. Pag sinabi mo, pag sinabi mo watashi wa doa o akimas, I will open the door. Pero pag sinabi mong doa ga akimas, the door is open. Okay? So, yun ang kaiba niya. Watashi wa, doa wa akimas, I will open the door. Doa ga akimas, the door is open. Okay? So, yun yung kaiba ng transitive at intransitive verb. Pag sinabi mong transitive verb is my door. Pag sinabi mong intransitive verb is walang door. Okay? Wala siyang door. Okay, sample pa, transitive verb. So, same with exam. Tomemas. Okay, to stop. Okay, so tomemas, siya is, dahil, di ba, sabi ko sa inyo, pagka kalimitan is malalambot, nung pumapasok siya kay transitive verb. Tomemas. Okay, siya is transitive verb. So, pag intransitive verb, siya is toma rimas. Okay? So, bistop. So, nakatigil. Transitive verb, tomimas. Intransitive verb is toma rimas. Example. Or, pwede to stop or pwede siya gamitin as to park. Okay? Kruma o Watashi wa kuruma o tomemas. Okay. I will stop the car or pwede siya I will park the car. So, tomemas ang ginamit yung kaya particle o kaya direct object na kuruma. E paano pag ginamit natin sa tumarimas at ginawa natin siya intransitive verb? Sinabi mo namang kuruma ga 
tumari mas meaning nakatigil yung sasakyan hindi mo alam kung sino nagpatigil or sino yung magpapatigil sinabi lang krumaga tumari mas okay so meaning nya the car stops okay etong isa I will stop the car or, or I will park the car kasi nga the transitive verb siya ginata CO and then transitive verb ginamit si particle ga okay same with the verb na she me mas and then she mari mas she me mas she is transitive verb then she mari mas is intransitive verb Okay, tadoshi or jidoshi. So, particle o, shimimimas ko doon niya sabi. Gusto niyo kalimitan malambot. And particle ga kay shimarimas. Okay, 